Okay, gather around for a story you don't want to miss. An act of kindness will make life a little easier for a disabled kindergartner in Virginia Beach. And as all thanks to an ambitious group of Old Dominion University students, Lauren Martinez joins us with this inspiring story. Well, performing daily tasks for Newcastle Elementary student Taylor Reynolds presents many challenges, and she has a limb difference in both hands, but she's determined to succeed. Taylor Reynolds has a condition called amniotic band syndrome, and in her six years of life, she's already braved through eight surgeries. Her mother says she's a trooper. The last surgery that she had in August was an actual finger rotation, so that now she has a pincher grasp on her right hand. She is a twin also, so I think it's hard for her seeing that her sister can do things that is either impossible for her or way more challenging for her right now. Taylor is met daily with constant struggles and no prosthetics to assist her. But she does have the support of her school counselor. It's really heartbreaking at times because even though we feel it internally and we see that there are differences that maybe she doesn't have the same opportunities that other kids have. Seeing Taylor's day to day disadvantages prompted Kimberly to step up and help in an even greater way. During a visit to Old Dominion University with her son, she pitched engineering students a brilliant idea for their year-end project after spotting a prosthetic device in their lab. I was like, oh my gosh, we can maybe get this device that um, Taylor needs and that would really help her out. She was like, well, we do have an organization that helps kids with special needs. They had decided that they were going to take her case. So she has one pointer finger in that hand right now. They're going to add additional fingers so that you know, she's able to grasp things, um, silverware, things like that. Right now, using the restroom is one of her biggest obstacles right now. Um, they're going to actually make a toileting tool so that she can do it on her own. What are you most excited to do after they make them? Um, play on the playground with my sister. Well, the ODU engineering students have taken Taylor's measurements and are currently working on prototypes, and they hope to complete the project by the end of summer.